Hello everyone and welcome to another video. So today we are going to talk about this issue where if you are trying to upgrade your Windows 10 to Windows 11 uh, which was just released publicly then you might have been facing this issue where it says that uh, VirtualBox or some other software and your PC requires the latest version of this app. So this is a problem that uh, you might face if you are trying to upgrade your uh, system from Windows 10 to Windows 11. So what this means is that there is a software in your system right now and uh, if you upgrade to Windows 11 it might stop working. So the step that you need to take next is uh, will depend upon the software that you have right now. So what you need to do is first of all if it is a software like VirtualBox which you might not need in everyday use then you can just uninstall the application and then try to refresh it and it will start working. So this would be the simpler option just uninstall the application that is stopping you from upgrading your system and when you uninstall it you will be able to continue with the process. Alright so the next thing if you are still unable to proceed uh, with the process uh, what you can do is go to your search bar over here and type down system information. You'll see an option like this click on it and you'll see a window and inside that you will have an option right in the bottom of the screen that says uh, a hypervisor has been detected and feature required for Hyper-V will not be displayed. So this is a feature that has been noted that stops you from upgrading your system from Windows 10 to Windows 11. So if you are using hypervisor which is something related to uh, virtualization and uh, VMware that we have just uninstalled if this is something that you don't use uh, regularly then what you can do is you can disable it for now and then enable it when Windows comes out with a fix or VirtualBox comes out with a fix. So what you need to do to disable it is you have to go to your start menu right here. Right click it and open PowerShell with admin. Once you open PowerShell with admin you will see a blue window like this. Now write down this command. Uh, you will see the command in the description of this video. The command is disable windows optional feature online feature name Microsoft Hyper V Hyper Visual. So this is the command that we will be using to temporarily disable the Hyper V Hyper Visual feature of Windows 10 and then once that is done we will be able to continue with the process. If you have an error like this on your screen uh, then it is completely fine you can just uninstall any virtualization software such as VirtualBox and then just uh, restart your system and once that is done you will be able to complete the process. So I really hope this helped guys and it is uh, it's a new video on Windows 11 I hope you like this. Uh, if you like this video click on the like button below and if you are new to the channel then just uh, click on the red subscribe button. Have a good one guys.